Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am going to be doing my May Ipsy bag. And I'm really excited. I'm always so excited when my Ipsy bag comes in the mail and I just want to open it so fast. So I got this yesterday. So let's open it up. Oh my gosh. This is my favorite by far. I've had Ipsy since august 2015 and this is my favorite bag yet it's it's different than all the other bags it doesn't have like a zipper at the top it has a cute little snap right here and oh my gosh it's just it's so so cute and it's got like the eiffel tower it's got pyramids um the thing from rio the statue of liberty airplanes um kangaroos Oh my gosh, it's just so pretty. Look at this. So I think just by looking at the bag that it is a traveling theme. Um, oh my gosh, I just I just love this bag so much. It's adorable. So I open it up, I take the card out. Destination Chick by Ipsy. Greetings from. So it's like a little postcard. On the back it has some questions that you can fill out and send back. This is so cool. Oh my goodness. So it's definitely like a traveling theme and I'm going to open this up and take something out and it is a brush. It says Slimmest slimmis Glam? I don't know what that says. Take it out of the wrapper. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It feels like it's really, really good quality. It's got gold right here and white. There's diamonds on it. This is so cute. It's got two diamonds on it and it's very, 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 very soft. And it says small contour W07. Oh my gosh. I love this brush. I love it, love it, love it, I love it, I love it. Now I just need to learn how to contour. Next I pull out, oh I think I already have this. Oh no, it's different. It's a Smashbox Mascara X Rated. So I have one from another Ipsy bag that's called something else. I forget what it's called. Full Exposure. Um, Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara. And this one is the X-Rated. So let me just open this up. I really, really, really like the Full Exposure one. So I'm wondering if I'm going to like this one. I'm really excited to try this because I really do like the other Smashbox mascara that I have. Next, I have, this is what I got with my points. Um, it is the Ami, Ami Natural Kind Morning Clear Purifying Facial Wash Moisturizing Facial Wash for Clear Soft Skin. So, it's just a face wash and I'm excited to try this out. Um, I have so many face washes from Ipsy, but I always wash my face, so I'm always going to use them. Next is a, another face wash. This is for Acne Pore Deep Cleansing. It's 28 Remedy Knots. Knots. Suitable for use of acne prone skin. And I do have acne. This is actually, my face is actually pretty clear. This is just a scab that keeps um, falling off and then bleeding again, so it's not really going away. But my face is actually super, super clear, and it's as clear as it's been for a long time, and I'm really happy about that. There are some, like, scarring, but yeah, so I do have acne-prone skin, so, so this will be good when my face starts to break out again, which I know it will. So hopefully this works with that and prevents it from getting worse. Next, I have this Bella Pierre Cosmetics Gel Lip Liner in Nude. So I'm going to open this because it's in a wrapper. Very pigmented. And I will definitely use this because 
if I don't line my lips it ends up looking kind of messy. I really do like lip liners. I don't have very many so I will add this to my collection. I definitely do not have a nude one. The last thing in my Ipsy bag is, it looks like a lip balm. It says it is a Jersey Shore Spa? Jersey Shore? What? Lavender Moisture Rich Hydrating Balm. Lavender. Lavender lip balm. I don't know. It says delicious. Right there. So I'm going to open it up if I can. Ugh. Why do they make this so difficult? I think I got it. There we go. It smells weird. I'm not sure if I like this. Feels like I just took like lavender and just rubbed it all over my face. Like, lavender, I like the smell of lavender, but the taste of lavender isn't very good. This is weird. It's moisture rich for sure and it's very hydrating I can tell it's just the the flavor and the smell of it isn't very good either so I don't I'm not really I'm not really liking that I'm not really liking that I definitely would not put this on my lips if I had to if my lips were like super super cracked and dry and bleeding I would put that on but other than that just to wear it like, I want to take this off right now. Like, that's how gross it is. I don't like it. I don't like that one. This bag itself was, like, worth the money for me because it's just that cute. And it's it's just that cute. I could definitely just put my makeup in here, throw it in my purse. It's like a little envelope. I love the bag so much. And I got a new mascara, a contouring brush, a gel lip liner, two face washes and a really gross lip balm so i would say this is not a very bad bag at all i'm very happy i'm always super happy with my ipsy bags um they're just so fun to open even if you don't like some of the products on the inside it's still really fun to open and see what you get my foot my foot my foot is asleep oh my god okay so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know if you got any of the same products as me in your Ipsy bag this month. And also I have a link down below that you can use to sign up for your Ipsy. It gives me some points and I believe it gives you some points too. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe because you love me. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Ah! Ah! My feet! Ah! My feet! Ah. Oh my god, they're sleeping. It's so bad. Oh my god. This is what I get for filming on the floor.